welcome back to our YouTube channel. As you can see, I'm sitting outside. I almost made a sweater. It is slightly on the cool side. But I just wanted to catch up with you guys and show you around a little bit. A few of you have commented to do a house tour. So I thought I would share our little space and also give you a little bit of an update. We have been silent on our channel for some time. Our um, electricity this week has not been good. It has been going off a lot. And then our Wi-Fi has also not been working. So we were just kind of stranded for a few days. But we are back and I thought I would share the little space that we live at. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. So we live in a gated community. I'm trying to get my phone to focus but there's a gate out here and then there's a soldier also there. Um, this is kind of the neighborhood that we're living in. There's apartment houses there, and then most of these other houses are by owners. There's a few empty plots as well, but I'm not sure exactly how many people are living here actually, but it goes straight up to there. Um, I don't know, is there like a half a dozen or more houses here and then here this is our landlord um, she has that gate with her family there and then this one here is our gate and we share this gate with um, a young family who lives here as well so this is our main gate. We have a key to open and close our gate. And we have this little man door. Um, and then as you come inside, this is our little house here. And we have some wash lines here that we hang our clothes. This little house here. Sorry, I'm trying to use my finger to point. Um, that's where our neighbors live and this is the main house where the landlady lives but she's like on the other side um, basically and our neighbors here and us we share this gate so let's go inside this is my husband's bike and this is also a gate that will go to our house. I've enjoyed this gate. It kind of keeps little children away. I also have a clothesline here that I wash, or I can hang my laundry underneath the roof. Um, I've enjoyed using that when it rains for sure. So this is our entry door. And then I have some, the things, uh, kind of my washing containers back here. I'll show you one day how I do laundry. I don't have a washer, unfortunately, but um, hopefully we'll get there. So I do it by hand. So let's go inside. Because African houses don't have nets or don't have screens on the windows, we have these nets. So coming inside, this is the entrance with the net and curtains. I have a small window here. And then from standing at the door, we have our toilet on the right side. We have a shower and a toilet in one here and a small sink. And then here is our bedroom give you a sneak peek of a nice mirror here um, yeah this is our bedroom and then 
coming out of the bedroom is the sitting room. So this is our sitting room. So our couch here. Some when we first started dating photos on the wall. I enjoy looking at those every now and then. And then um, we have our TV. Excuse all that mess back there. I'm hoping to be able to put a board or something to kind of cover that up. But we have a TV stand and then our table, coffee table, you would call it in the U.S., but it's kind of our table. We eat and do everything from there. So off from the sitting room, there's a guest bedroom and then the little kitchen. So I'll take you to the guest bedroom. It's like a guest bedroom slash um, storage, I guess you could say. We have our shoe rack there and a wardrobe and then an extra bed. And then you come out to my little kitchenette. We have a full fridge and a full stove, which I'm so happy about. Um, I enjoy using the oven stove. And I got some onions that I'm trying to dry. But yeah, this is my little kitchen space. Um, I have some cupboards up here, and then there's like little shelves on the side. I have my spices and, you know, all that good stuff there. But, um, that's my little kitchen area. I have a container of rice, and I put ugali flour in the bottom one, and then, um, we have our gas there. A drying mat hanging there in my lower doors which I really enjoy so yeah that is a slash of our kitchen <laughs> 